I'm Chuck. And I'm Billy. And this Wait. is our nature show. Learning how to survive in the wild has been a stepping stone for Chuck and Billy's massive lifestyle. Surviving out in the wild has really got me more fit than the gym could ever. Today we'll be scavenging for berries and learning how to make them. Right over there. Oh my god. Now this is rare. Usually you don't find this berries this very fast as you would now. And now we're experts obviously, so we're gonna find them super fast. Now this is a wild Canadian juniper. Juniper berry, that's what I'd say. Can't be anything else. Now oh. Billy. Really, really smells. Tonight, we feast. We feast. Billy. <laughs> Billy, are you okay? I'm good. Okay. Not the not the best tasting berry I'd recommend finding in different one. <laughs> I'll tell you what. But when you're in a survival situation, anything's good. Anything counts. If you're in a if you're in a survival situation like we yeah, are. Yeah, if you're in a survival situation like we are right now because we there's no civilization anywhere around us. These bears are really going to give you substance. Look at these ants. Those you can munch up. Anteaters do it. Look how thick they are. That you see that tiny boy right there? That ant? Yeah. There's Ready? some nutrients in that. Mm. It really it's really good. I'm just gonna stick with it. Billy, I think we should cut this. Now today we're gonna also be making a bow. So what we're looking for now is a nice pile of sticks that some nerd has left behind. Ah, right over here. As you can see, some nerd left all of his sticks just laying around. Who would do that? Now, obviously when I'm surviving, I always like to keep my duct tape with me. And my string. Now, if you have duct tape and string, you basically have the key to the world. There's nothing. Right here. As you can see, that is a premium stick for bow build. First, we're gonna need string, a stick, and, and duct tape if you're into that sort of thing. So first, what you wanna do, bend it, oh, yep. Obviously, you wanna tie your string, so take it. Here, let me get in close, let me get real close. Right. You wanna do, you wanna do, you wanna do a simple knot. You know, just like that. Now that, that's one of the best knots you can do, honestly, in a survival situation. Holds, hold on, hold on. Holds better than your grandma's dentures. You want to tie it, and maybe if you're feeling, if you're feeling kinky, maybe even go around one more time. So then we we get down here, yeah, D down, yeah, that's good. Uh, down here, you want to kind of do the same thing. Uh, you want you 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 want to uh, you want to feel free to use duct tape. Yeah, you want to you want to take you want to make another one, and we we actually don't have quite enough string, so we're just gonna wrap it around and. And and uh and uh and uh, uh um uh we're gonna duct tape. Yeah, we're gonna put a piece of uh, um uh mm, uh. Oh, my lips, Billy. It's okay. Just stick with it, Chuck. Tape it on, brother. Oh yeah. So I'm gonna go off and find an arrow. We'll see you soon. Hey, Chuck, I'm gonna go set up a target for you. Okay,